we're going to take a look at the Game Center application for the iPhone. If we open the Game Center app, here we'll be taken to the main screen. Once we open it, we'll be asked if we'd like to have Facebook recommendations for finding friends. We can allow it or dismiss it for later. Here we can see this is our profile page. If we'd like to change our photo, just tap change photo and we can choose from a photo, take a photo, or delete our photo. We can change our current status by tapping on our status and hitting the blue X and then typing in our new status. Once we're done, we can press the friends tab and here we can see all the friends that we've added and we can also see Facebook recommendations or recommendations based upon friends we already have. We can even view our recent friends. We can view our friends as points. If we press the plus button in the top left hand corner, we can send a friend request. We can either send it by email or nickname, then we can even type in a custom message if we would like to. If we press on the games tab, we can see all the games that we've played that are Game Center enabled, and we can also see all the recommendations that we have based upon games that we've played and games that our friends have played. If we go back to the main games tab and we can select on a game that we've played, here we can see all of our leaderboard scores, our achievements, and we can even see which of our friends have played this game. If we wanted to, we can launch the game by pressing play in the top right hand corner. If we press the challenges tab, here we can receive challenges from friends to beat their scores or earn achievements. We can challenge our friends by going into our games tab and selecting the score from the game that we'd like to play. If we press the request tab, here we can see any friend requests that we have. We can add friends by pressing the add friends button and here we can type in their email or their nickname or we can send them a friend request by pressing the plus button in the top left hand corner.